How's it going? Mower Outlaw here. Um, I was just scrolling around on Facebook and was talking to a young gentleman and he is also a Craftsman fan as I am and was asking me how I built the front bumper on my camo machine named Castle. Um, so I'm going to do a little up close and personal with the bumper I built a little while ago. I probably should have made a video. Um, but it was just kind of a spur of the moment, wanted to do it, and really didn't think about making the video when I did it, but here's a video now. Check this out. Basically what I did was I took some quarter by four plate steel, and I ran it all the way far back until where the front end mounts into the frame. There's a little lip here that's factory. And there's some factory holes. So what I did is I cut two plates, one for each side. I clamped them together, the two plates, and then I clamped it here. And I put a pen on the inside, drew the, the circles where the holes are, and kept the two plates clamped together, drilled straight through. So I had the correct holes, put those in, got them to sit level, and bolted them tight. And I made these pieces. Sorry the lighting kind of stinks. Um, basically just 45s. You know, I measured here to here. Made two of them. You know, so you can see one on that side there. <clears throat> and welded them on straight. Now this front part here, the actual bumper, this tubing, this is the cross shaft tubing that goes between the landing legs of an 18 wheel trailer. Those are the front legs, and you go up and down. Um, it's basically like some inch and a quarter tubing, eighth inch wall. Um, so I took two lengths, I think it's like 36 or 37 inches long. Stitch welded it. See, it's like an inch weld, inch weld, inch weld, and I did on opposite on the back side. Um, basically, I fish mouthed the ends, put some uprights, and fish mouthed. And then just put a crossbar. Um, put that all together. Then I went ahead and I put, I don't know if you can see, there's a plate of steel here. That's the plate that the winch is actually mounted down to. This is a cross plate that's just stiffening up the whole front end of it. Um, but the winch is bolted down with just the regular winch mounts. Um, and then here, See, there's a plate here. Um, basically, all that is is a piece of quarter inch by four inch plate steel. Same stuff I use for these side brackets. Um, and it fit on the back side here. It fit well. So I just ground it down and I, you know, I welded the ends with a little stitch in the end, top and bottom. Cut a hole way bigger than where the cable is going to go through for the fair lead. And I just held the fail lead there and marked the holes and drilled the holes. Well, there it is. Um, it's the front bumper of my tractor castle. There it is. Uh, I'm Over Outlaw. If you get any more questions about Castle, any more questions about Banner or the Loner Murray or any of the machines I have, anything you want to see done to them. Um, if I like your idea, hell yeah, I'll go for it. Uh, if I don't like your idea, well then, sorry I don't like it. But, more outlaw. Like, subscribe, comment, tell your friends. See you later. Bye.